Oh, 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 yeah, that, that is powerful, powerful this morning. That joy is going mightily this morning. So come in, come in, come in, and get the all in on all of this happiness and joy this morning. It is marvelous. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, so many things are flowing which we just never even receive. So many gifts are given to us which we never receive. And did you realize that you are what you accept? There's so many things that we don't accept. We just don't realize they're there, so we don't accept them. But when you get down to it, the number of things that you accept that are good a number of good powers and the good joys and the good happinesses that you accept determine who you become and now who you are. So it's so glorious to realize that. So then we can begin to ask ourselves what joys are there that I have not yet accepted. And then when we realize, oh yes, what they are, we can start accepting them. Then it will be like I was feeling then. Woo! Yes! Whoa! 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 Oh, glory! It's so shakingly glorious. Yes, yeah, so marvelous when it starts really pouring across you. And you start feeling that power. Oh, yes, I was over there a while ago over there uh, in the place where I pray, standing up sometimes. I uh, stand up place to prayer. And then I have another, uh, I have an actual prayer room further on back. But over there where I was standing, I, I was receiving such power that I was shaking all over and I was running and jumping. Oh, yes, it was so powerful. And we need to be realized more of that. Oh, yes, you need to turn this on every day and accept all these things as they're coming out and begin to let them flow in your life so that you will have them working and making you a person of joy and happiness in every way because what you accept becomes what you are if you're turning down joys and turning down happinesses that you could have then you're just missing out on the energy that you could have in your life you're missing out on the healing power that you can have in your life oh yes yes it is Receive the power now. It's time to receive more joy. Time to receive more happiness. Time to reach up and accept your healing. The healing power is here now, and it is time to receive it. Yes, I'm going to receive it. When I realize that something needs to be healed, what do I say? Do I complain and cry? No, I say, I receive it. I receive it now. And then that energy flows across every cell in our in my body. And I heal, feel the healing radiance like you cannot believe. Oh, dear God. Oh, there must be a million suns shining out of me. Oh, when that healing power begins to blow, it's like a million suns shining every direction. Whoa! Oh! 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 Where is my cameraman so I can run? I'm going to have to get a cameraman that can follow me so I can run a mile or two on this thing. I might have to get me one of those on a stick that I can go along. And I can go out and run when I get this feeling and run for two or three miles and, and be doing my videos uh, while I'm running. <laughs> and so I can feel this energy all the way in the run and in the jump. I can jump and run. Whoa, yes, we feel like jumping and running and, and going down through 
We can run through the parts. We can run through the valleys. Oh, yes. Anything gets in our way, we'll just jump over it. Yes, it's a powerful morning. Oh, yes, it was been such a powerful morning. Such miracles and so many healings and so much powerful testimony. And oh, my Lord, it's so wonderful. You need to really begin to realize how happy and joyful you can be. Oh, yes. Just lift up your hands now with me and let us demonstrate this power now. Oh, yes. Lift up your hands now. Oh, with that power. Lift them up. Lift them up. Lift them up higher. 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 Lift the hands. Lift them up. Lift them up. Lift them up and receive. And as they go up, let your consciousness go up. Whoa! 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 Oh! Receive it! Receive it! Receive it! And it's so marvelous when we think about this thing. And when we think about and when we hear these things, and then we are able to receive these things, not just hear them, but receive them and know in our spirit what to do with them and have all that resistance out of the way where they will, where these truths will come right on in and do their work. And that we practice this, the point of practicing this joy like this every day is that we keep all of that resistance washed out. And so then when the truth comes, we're ready to shout. We're ready to jump and lift our hands. Whoa! And go because we know what that truth means and what it's going to do for us. And we don't hold back. We don't hold back. It's important that you don't hold back. Because when you hold back, that joy is going to turn away. When you hold back, the energy is going to turn away. It's going to say, well, this person doesn't want it. You know, you say, well, I'm afraid somebody might see me jumping and shouting. You know, and they might think I'm something I'm not or whatever. And so you'll turn that away, and then it'll just turn and go away. And uh, th- then you'll just miss out on that because the joy and the happiness will. Somebody said the joy and the happiness has ears that can hear and uh, can feel what you are thinking and what you are saying. And so when that when the joy and the energy and the healing power hears heals you say, Oh, I don't know, I don't know, I better not do this because somebody might think I'm silly or they might might think I'm something I'm not or oh I don't know, I don't believe in this and, and so that just turns it away because it hears that and it says this person is not ready. Because what you're ready for, you you are gonna have what you are ready for. What you are ready for is ready for you. What you accept is going to accept you. If we can just remember those two things, that what you're ready for is ready for you, and what you can accept is ready to accept you, then we'll be on our way to receiving that healing power that will be so glorious that we'll feel like our face is shining like the sun across this universe. Oh, Lord, give us that power and that joy now. Give us all of this energy now. Give us all of this healing power. I want to hear. I want to feel that healing power flow. I want to feel me, it, it to fill me up so much that I'll have plenty of it to roll over on other people. Oh, don't stop when you get your own healing, but keep going until you rolls over. On, you get enough healing power that it rolls over on other people. Just keep going with the healing. You keep. Keep going with that power. Keep letting the oceans of, of joy and healing and energy wash over you. Keep letting it go. Keep letting it roll. Keep letting it blow. Or keep letting it show. Oh, we got to really get that power going. And we want to feel. We want to feel that holy shake. We want to feel them holy jumps. We want to feel them holy leaps. We want to feel that low uh, leaps of energy. We want to feel the leaps of power. We want to fl- feel the leaps of love, joy, and peace of every kind. We want to feel it leaping up within us. We want to feel the power. Whoa! Whoa! Ah, I want to feel that power. Yes, we want to. Go up 
been to the mountain top and look over into the promised land of all healing power and peace and love and see how far it stretches out before us and know what all God has planned for us to be, to be able to accept so that we'll know what we have there to accept and then we will be able to fully accept it. And we'll know that when we'll look out across there and see all those things and we'll say, I know that whatever I accept of those things, will that is what I will be. The number of them that I accept is, is what I'll actually become and I'll actually be. Those things that you turn away, then you won't have those to, to increase your power and your energy, your creative thought, your healing power, and all the rest of it. So let's just begin to realize how many wonderful anointings are available for us to receive. How much all of gladness and joy is able to pour out upon our head. How much God is able to pour out on us right now. How strong is those Niagara's of power that can flow in us now. How glorious is that spout that we're going to get under that spout where the glory comes out. How glorious is it? How wonderful is it? How healing is it? How anointing is it? How much power will it give us? How much are we able to heal from it? Oh, if we stay under that spout where the glory comes out long enough, we'll be able to heal all things. It, it will be like getting under a spout where healing power flows out. Yes, and we want all that. We want that rivers. We want those rivers to flow and we want them to have many, many tributaries that will reach all people that need healing. We want to be able to stand upon this world and look down and see all the people that need healing and flow those rivers of power and healing out to reach every person that needs to be healed or raised up of anything. Every person that needs to be raised out of a bad habit, needs to raise out of addiction, immediately will be raised by the power of God into their resurrected above that mortality and mortal thinking that causes them to be addicted. Oh, yes, uh, it's only mortal thinking that causes you to feel oppressed or depressed or obsessed by something. And once you rise above that mortal thinking, it immediately drops off. There's no more addiction to anything. No addiction to anything. All there is is the flow of joy and peace and power. And that's all you feel. You don't feel any kind of drawing to anything else in this world. Only joy and peace and love and healing power. That's all you feel drawn to. And so you become full of it because you think about it all the time. And you become imbued with healing radiance and superfluous power and superfluous energy. And so I'm going to pray right now that everyone listening to this will receive all of this power now that it will blow across him. Oh, by, and by, in the name of the Holy Son, Jesus, Father, heal people now by the power of God. Touch them and touch them and touch them now and heal them and raise them up out of all illnesses, anything from heart disease, uh, cancer, diabetes, uh, Oh, dear God, Parkinson's, anything, Lord. Oh, lupus, heal them now in the name of the Holy Son, Jesus, and raise them up above all obsession, depression, or, oh, dear God, oh, 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 oppression. And raise them out of any thoughts of being oppressed or obsessed or depressed. Raise them out of any valley that they may have fallen into and raise them up to that high mountain of joy and peace and happiness like never can believe until you receive it. Let them accept more. And so they'll be more. Let them feel more. So they'll flow more. Let them have more. So they'll be more. And they'll flow more. And they'll be healed more. And more people will be healed. In the name of thy Holy Son, Jesus, now let us be happier than we've ever been before. Let us receive more anointing than we ever received before. Let us receive more power than we ever received before. Oh, in the name of thy Holy Son, Jesus, amen, amen, amen. Oh, yes, give us happiness, give us power.